Hello, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Forager. Before we do anything today, we're making the robotic shovel because we have everything we need to make it. Give me that shovel. Okay, it might take a little while. So uh, we'll just sit and wait. And I don't think there's really anything else I can make right now. Uh, let's just see. While we wait for that, we'll look at everything else and everything else that we cannot make and cry a little bit. <laughs> nah, it's fine. Fiberglass. We need a lot of royal clothings. How many? I do have quite a bit of gems. Uh, let's make four. What are we running out of? Uh, leather. Uh, four royal clothings. Big deal. yippity doo -dah. Uh And then royal steel. 16. What are we running out of? Steel. Let's make that. We got more steel coming. All right. So that should be plenty of royal steel and everything in there. And we got money. Let's see how much money we get for emptying the bank. <laughs> a lot. We're going to get a lot of money right now. We're level 43. Excellent. Give me that poop. 10,000 monies. Again. That's amazing. And we almost have a shovel. Uh, let's... Let's pick a... Pick a skill, any skill. So we're gonna go into the skull maze today. Now, engineering. Unlocks droids. <laughs> we don't need that. We don't need that, guys. It's fine. It's fine. What do I want? What do I want? I have no idea. Frost strike. Did I ever get that? Spirit crystals. Oh. Yeah, let's get that. I don't care anymore. We can get spirit crystals. Hang on here. I think that's how we make... Let's see. Wait a minute. Necronomicon. How do I make that? Oh, uh, I need five royal clothings. We're not going to make that yet. That's not vital at the moment. Okay. Uh, spirit crystal. Ah. Crystal and 15 steel. Hmm. And we got the shovel. Well... Dig area increase. Digging always yields rare items. Oh my god. Seriously? Seriously? Right now? What, what do you consider a rare item? An arrow? We got plastic from digging. Oh my god. Okay. We need more lighthouses <laughs> over here. Dude, yes. This shovel is crazy. So how much plastic do I have? Hang on. I'm exhausted from digging up all this amazing stuff. Sure. Okay. I understand. Have some meat. Let's go to the skull maze in a minute here. Let me just sell. Get out of my way, flower press. Lose my patience with you. Let's sell these arrows we don't need. We have 10.3 thousand monies. All right. And yeah, that's on. That's fine. We got a bunch of stuff crafting. Let's go. We have everything we need. I believe. Yeah, let's just go. Skull maze time. We're going to get through the skull maze without taking any damage. Which should be easy. Should be very easy. Hello. Here. I need a nice screenshot of this thing. <laughs> get out of my way, experience. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Into the skull maze. Into the depths. So we have our... Uh, can I just... There we go. We'll light all these. Let's carry a bomb around with us too. The music is different in here, I think. Is it? No. All right. So this is a maze, as the name implies, very strongly. <laughs> and uh, we have to make our way through it without taking any damage. And it's going to be easy because skeletons will not attack us now. But we're going to, after we finish this place, we're going to come back in to it. Let's just stick to the left wall. How about that? That's the strat right now. Um, do I need to kill you? Not really. Let's just uh, make sure we eat. Because we got to get through here without damaging ourselves. And that includes taking damage from food or lack thereof. Hunger, I should say. 
And I'm also, you know, trying to look for the secret rooms. Oh my god, don't hit me. Alright, do number keys work? They do. Oh, that helps a lot. Uh, hey, give me that. Give me some loots. Alright. Yeah, because once you have a lot of things in your hotbar, like scrolls and all this other stuff you got, like scrolling through it with the mouse wheel takes some time. But now I could just, you know, go like this and boom. And then go back to, what, seven? All right, seven is bomb. Good to know. Uh, I already forgot which wall I'm sticking to. I guess we're sticking to the left wall, but I may have lost the left wall. It's fine. I think I'm going back to where I came from. And I still haven't found the... No, we're not going back. Alright, fine. I didn't need that fairy, but it's okay. Seven. Alright. I still haven't noticed any... We got a lot of bombs, so... Yeah. I think there are three... Uh, hidden rooms in here. Pretty sure, unless it's changed since the last time. Okay, we're still sticking to this wall. Alright. It's just the secret rooms are harder to see now. They're more secret. And so, yeah. I do like the music a lot. I think it has changed. It sounds creepier than it used to. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe it's just me? But I'm pretty sure it's a different song. Because I have spent a lot of time in this place in the past. <laughs> Wandering around aimlessly. Trying to find all the secrets. So, we're just gonna stick to this wall. It's more of like a, wait, there's something down there, but I think we access it from this side. Who knows, though? Yeah. It's not over here yet. There we go. There's one. Yes. Yes. Give me that treasure. All these gems. We have 12.3 thousand monies now. Hey, you get killed. Thank you. Like that. Give me that. Give me them bones. Alright. So far, so good. Let's eat before we forget. Remember, we can't take any damage in here. It's of utmost importance that we remain damage free. No damaggio. Alright, so we got Skellingtons, the land of the Skellingtons, that's where we are. And we get this, the Necro Rod. Use it to summon Skeletons. This I've never had, I think. Unless I got it like right at the end. So we have too much stuff. Where is it? We have too many things in our hotbar, it looks like. Hey, alright. Hopefully I don't have to use the Necro Rod to solve anything in here. Now, I'll use that. Why not? Alright, boop. So we found... Oops. Two secret rooms so far, and then the third is down below us, all the way down in the corner. Which we'll work our way back to. I'm just gonna... Go up this way. Wait a minute. Nope. Nothing there. So I said, like, in the beginning of this, usually I'm really good at following a wall. Like, I've been through, you know, many, many a dungeon in my time that's all maze-like. I mean, I've played the original Fantasy Star games, so yeah. Those have, like, some of the most intense maze dungeons ever. There's like a dungeon in that game. It's a JRPG. Old school. And uh, there's a dungeon that has like 70 floors. 
<laughs> it's insanity. The dungeons in that series are just crazy. Mazes. And, uh, yeah. Been through them. Usually I'm really good at just sticking to a wall in something like this. But right now, un unfortunately, I'm not really sticking to a wall. I'm just like, oh, let's go this way. It's fine. It's just fine. So, I mean... Pathfinder, complete the skull maze, and we get those wings. Yes. And that. The spirit orb. Use it to increase your stats. And then we should hopefully, yes, let's go back in. And now we're going to stick to the right wall. We're going to go this way. What the heck? See, I don't know if there's a secret for uh, lighting all of the torches the sconces get out of here punks uh but and we didn't get the the feet is there no longer a feat where you have to complete a dungeon without taking any damage maybe it's because we didn't complete it i hope we didn't mess that up that's that would be unfortunate, if so. Alright, we're sticking to the... This wall. The right wall. Alright. I'm just gonna keep my cursor on it. Or try to. Alright, so we're back here. There is definitely something in here that we... Have not found yet. Oops. Definitely, definitely something in here that I have not found. I'm going to have to come back in here a third time. Because I'm still trying to, like, complete it and maybe get that. Wait, did we get it? Hang on, let me check. I can't check my feats. Can't check my feats. -a. So, wait a minute. We're already, we're following this wall. All right, there's nothing here. Go back around. Yeah, we got to go down here. All right. I wish I could check my feats in here to see whether or not I got that. So I don't have to come in here a third time, but it's all right. The reason why is there is a deal with the devil. There's a cursed chest in here. And that's why I have all this HP. See what I'm getting at, guys? I took... I've been using my spirit orbs, which we have another one. We might as well... Another HP increase. Um, the reason why I've been getting HP... Using my spirit orbs to get all this HP... Is because the cursed chest in here... Uses or takes HP from you... When you use it. You donate max HP to get something. And I... Want to get something. And I'm donating... Max HP in order to get them. That's what I'm saying. Them... What does he mean by them? People know. <laughs> there it is, right there, that thing. Hmm. But first I have to, like, you know, I'm going to edit the third third uh, journey back through this place. I might even edit this right now. Who knows? Nobody knows. I kind of want to go down that way, because I think that I already followed this wall once before. But... Yeah, let's see. Let me edit this down a little bit. Alright, guys. So don't do what I did. I knew that opening that large chest all the way to the in the top area was going to end the dungeon. But I thought, because I could keep coming back in, that I could just complete it at any point. But you have to kind of... You have to complete the dungeon before you get the final reward of the dungeon. So keep that in mind when you play this. Don't do what I did. Because there is a feat, I can't show it to you right now, uh, to complete a dungeon without taking any damage. And the skull maze, this area, is by far the easiest if you have the skeleton mask. Ske skeletons won't attack you. So you could basically just walk through the entire place. As long as you don't take damage from lack of energy, or anything, then you're good. 
but I cannot do that. So now in order for me to get that feat in this playthrough, I'm going to have to complete, you know, either the desert dungeon or the fire volcano dungeon without taking any damage, which is fine. I could do that. No big deal, especially soon, especially soon. Now, this is the deal with the devil. This is the cursed chest and we're going to open it. Gluttony or madness lose a max HP instantly level up three times. I should get that. Yeah, I have to boom. I have to get that. And then we're going to do it again. Another madness. Oh my God. I don't even want that. I don't even want that. We're going to go for avarice for now because I need that stuff anyway. Doom, bunch of demonic magic scrolls or termination gain droids and grenades. This is actually what I came in here to do. This is the easiest way to get droids, Me like get a bunch of HP from all the spirit orbs that the game gives you early on. And then you don't have to worry about crafting droids, which takes some time and a lot of materials. You can get droids just like this. So I have one. I'm going to actually get some more, get, get a bunch of potions or summon challenging enemies. Uh, I think I have to do this. Oh my God. In order to... Yeah. Perform a challenging blood ritual. So we've done that. I took some damage doing it, but... Oh, there was still one alive. Okay. There we go. And... So doing the, the blood... That challenge thing... Oh my god, level up three times. I gotta do that. Level 49. Again? Oh my god. Well... 52, and then challenge or termination. That's what I wanted. Okay, we're gonna stop now. So I have two droids. I have Rigo and D second. They're droids. Now let me get out of here. Uh, shouldn't be that hard if we stick to this wall. Pretty sure this will lead me back out quickly. Maybe. So yeah, that's why I wanted to stack up all that HP. Trying to get the termination boon to get droids it's an easy way to get droids now i could keep doing it you know i could keep coming in here that's the thing but i didn't really want to get all those levels but it's you know with the choices i had it was probably it was the by far the best thing to get later on like i don't remember what the max interesting I don't remember what the max level is. I think it's 64, right? Is it 64? So we still have a while to go. And it's now that we're such a high level, it's going to take a while to level up naturally. So we're going to need all the help we can get. It's still, it takes a lot of effort to max out your level. I mean, a lot of effort or a lot of uh, taking advantage of a lot of different things. Now, where is the exit? Right here. All right. So obviously we did not complete this dungeon without taking damage, but that's okay. We'll do another one. It's fine. It's just fine. So for now, uh, we have droids. They're going to be awesome. Thank you, my droid friends. And let's build that spirit crystal because I think with that I can make uh, good things. <laughs> So I don't want to hit the beats. All right. We're going to also, since I have scrolls, or I have scrolls. All right. So this pops out now. I just can't use it in there. I see. I see. So we can summon skeletons. That's really cool. So this is a good way to get a lot of bones. You know, lots of bones. Let's make fiberglass. Uh, no. Electronics, we need plastic. Let's make as much plastic as we can make and get a bunch of bottled oil and then make more bottles, uh, which are not made there. They are made right here. 69 bottles. Sure. Why not? And then more thread. And then also 
Let's see. Electronics, fiberglass, fiberglass. We need a lot of that. So I need a bunch of this stuff right here. I can only make three of them because I need a leather. Okay. I can make leather now. 24 leather. Okay. Cool. So yeah, droids are going to fly around like zapping everything and collecting things for me too. So good stuff. Now, uh, let me put this stuff away. Go in there. Bones, where are my bones? Right here, go in there. Flowers are in the first one, go in there. Gems are right here. All right, and fire right here, fire. Fire Blossom, I think it's called, most likely. Big Skulls are in here. EMP Grenades, we're gonna, okay, do that. For now, topaz, oops, there we go. Nightshade in here. Then demon uh, talons, demon horns, boom. All right, and then let's see. This will go here. Gel will go here. We got bottled oil, which we're actually, where is that? Bottled oil, I guess right here. Boom. And we got to cook some food. Cook that fish and cook that meat. Yes. All right. So we have nine skill points. That's insanity. And yeah, get all my stuff. Look at that. See, they just like collect for you. It's great. The only thing is I want to use this. Let's actually, we're going to get more here. Let's use this animals. Glittery animals drop more resources animals and fairies spawn near you and then we're gonna do we need to Hmm This isn't the best place to do this, but this is where all of my okay, We're just gonna do this right here. Okay, that's fine. And then we're gonna turn them into animals and then I need to chicken Give me my golden egg We probably need a liquid luck for this, but hey, stop it. I'm just gonna use all my animal feed for now. Actually, you know what? Let's get poop. Because I need to make more animal feed. Oops, I just killed something. Uh, we got two golden eggs. We got them. Nice. Very nice. Okay. So we could turn that in right now. Man, this is nutty. Here, give me that. Nutty. We'll use our XP soon. Hey, buddy. Hey, talk to me. This is surprisingly underwhelming. It won't hatch into a lovely bird friend. And I can't even eat it. Those are the only purposes of an egg. This has been disappointing. Yeah, old people helper. <laughs> Wait, did it give it to me? No. All right, so we got another one, another spirit orb. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I really want to use that for right now, but it'll be okay. Uh, so wait, we helped him completely. Yeah, walk into the waterfall, thanks. There's no waterfall in this game, unless, unless they're adding a water, waterfall, water, a waterfall. Um, I want to change my wings. To the bone wings. Yes, excellent. Bone wings, it is. They fit with a lunatic cultist a little bit more than the mercy wings, although I do really like the mercy wings as well. Now, let's see. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Magical island. Well, should we level? No, I want to make this first. Spirit crystal. Okay, perfect. Spirit crystal goes, I don't know, right here, right here. Boom. All right. And here, let's see. Great skull I can make with bones. Oh, spirit orb. I Wait, blizzard rod? Frozen, 10 frozen relics, 10 frozen squids, and 100 great skulls. Okay. Death rod. See, you need a bunch of these things. All right. Spirit orbs cost that stuff. Okay. 
That's cool. And there's two things. Oh, those are the other rods, the upgrades for them. Nice. Very nice. Uh, so yeah, let's make 41 great skulls. We're gonna need a lot of them. But I mean, I could use this. Oh my God, look at all these things. Here, let's make, since we have all this poop, we should have a lot of poop. 346, that's cool. Here, let's make uh, animal feed. 145 animal feed. Uh, 144 animal feed. We need flowers now. Hopefully I get plenty of flowers. Oh boy. And what, what else? What else do I want to do right now? It's just insanity. I guess level up. That's what I want to do. Alright, so we got a bunch of stuff. Uh, we can unlock droids. <laughs> Capitalism, gain XP when selling items. I don't really care about XP right now. Items discarded from your inventory are sold instead. We have nine skill points. Here, let's get the basics done. Get that. Carpentry, torches, and less wood. Whatever. And then we'll get potions. Expert potions. So we can finally do that. Reagency. Sure. Sure. And then what is this? Transmutation. Allows cauldrons to morph steel into gems. Yeah. Let's get that. Because I'm going to need plenty of gems. Many. Shrines recharge twice as fast and buffs last 50% longer. Very nice to have that. And agriculture. Farms yield more resources. So do animals. And we unlock sprinklers. I want to make a farm soon. A farm island. And veracity. Gain 20% more energy when eating. Uh, sure. Why not? Don't matter. All right. So look at that. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Maybe. Fourteen or so skills. Before we completely max out... Which is nice. We have a lot more steel. Hurry up and finish. Uh, we could make another shrine. Yes, we can. Cost of royal steel. We're gonna make another one. Right here. And... Colonist or hoarder. Yes. Resources drop double items. Let's go digging. This is gonna be great. Give me everything. Give me all the things. We're just gonna go around digging everywhere. Wow, energy. Don't die. <laughs> Look at all that stuff. Oh my god, did you see all that plastic? I'm not attacking you. You're gonna have to kill me. This is insanity. I just wanna see what, how much stuff we have. Ow, stop. I guess we're gonna have to keep eating too. Let's see how much stuff we have after we're finished digging. The entire world. And we're going to be able to buy more islands, too. We're going to buy that big island. No, I think that was 19,000. That's crazy sauce. Okay, fine. I'll eat again. Do you have anything else you want? You look very fashionable. Thank you. With my wings and stuff. All right, fine. I'll eat. All right. We need digging spots. Man. There is a shrine buff that causes a bunch of digging spots to spawn. I need an island, like an empty island. I need a good empty island that has just a lot of, okay. A lot of space for things. Alright. Oh my god, don't switch to a different item. You know, don't accidentally do it, Fury. <laughs> I've been teasing it this whole time. I like messing with everyone. But I'm gonna accidentally kill the beats. They'll be as long as the the droids don't accidentally kill them. You know, as long as the droids are good, good little droids, then the beats should be around forever. 
Alright, I have to see what we have after this. I don't know if we're gonna get any, like, any of the archaeological finds. But we have a lot of plastic. You see all that plastic we're digging up? That's amazing. Alright, that buff is still active. Give me that digging spot. I should eat. Oh my god. We don't have a mining rod up here. Well, let's change that real quick. Mining rod right here. Thank you. Now go and get everything for me. I'm missing a mining rod up here too. Ah, there's no bridge to Terabithia. Wait, we can just break stuff here. I could just do that. Get out of my way. All right. This shovel is amazing, by the way. It really is. Uh, another mining rod, like up here-ish. There we go. All right. So I can't make any more mining rods, I think. Stop saying you're hungry. You eat way too much. Way too much. We have four of these. Wow. Uh, so I think that buff just wore off. Look at all these things. Oh my god. Gems. Glittering jewels. Alright, so we're, we're good. We're good. Here. Boom. Alright. So that was amazing. Uh, 17,000. Let's see if we can break the bank here. Let's see if we could get it. Come on, collect my goodies. Get it. Alright. We have 19.1 thousand. How much does that island cost? Oops, we can't even get it. We're too low. Let's go up here. Come on, get out of my way. We have to make uh, more landfill items very soon. Alright, so we're here. Now, nah, buy land. We can buy it. I'm buying it. Don't kill them. You better not kill them, droids. Don't do it. I will be upset. I'll be very, very upset if you... You kill these things. Here. I think they've already been collected. These are magical deer. And they drop coins. When you when you feed them or anything. Here, let me feed you. Where'd you go? Here. Give me that money. See? Isn't that amazing? Stay up there forever. Be safe. Be wild. I'll see you on the next adventure. Alright. So, um, I guess we're done for now. I just want to see how much plastic I have. And we got to... Uh, store. Here, let's store the golden eggs in here. I think we need them, probably. We'll, we'll save them. Arrows, I don't think I need at all. We'll sell them. These EMP grenades, they're cool and all, but, you know, a little bit of overkill. I don't really, uh, here, sell that. We got eggs and sand. I think I have plenty of both, both of those things. Where's my sand? Sand. 5.1k. Right, we only got one of these. I gotta start making that stuff. Wait, how many eggs? Oh my god. <laughs> That's insanity. Uh, Alright. We have 43 of these. We got 13 of those. I need to make more of that. We should be able to now. Well, hopefully. Got 176 poop. Alright. We got 18 steel. I need a lot more steel. It's being cooked up, but 10,000 of that. So, yeah. Next time, I'm going to use all of these animal feeds to get a bunch of poop. And then we need, like, around here. I might make here. Let's see. Where's my steel? 99 more steel is being made. We're still making those bars. Um, let's see. Let's make more royal clothings. I can make 20 before we run out of leather. And then this, can I make leather? I can make 25 more leather. Okay. And then here, we're just going to make more thread. There we go. Check that out. Boom. All right. And then I'm going to have to get more... I'm sorry. It's way too overpopulated, and I need some hide. I'm sorry. I apologize. Oh my god, it's a slaughter. That's crazy. Okay, so now we should have plenty of hides and meat. 
I've got tons of stuff. Here, pick everything up, droid, my droid friends. My robots. We got bottles cooking up. Here, let's cook actual food. 61 of those. 335 meat. Oh my god. All right, guys. I'm going to end this one here. Things are getting insane. This game is insane. And uh, we're going to have to start thinking about which dungeon we want to try to get through without taking any damage. That's going to suck. <laughs> we need more droids, I think, before we try to do that. Just so they can kill everything before it has a chance to damage me. Anyway, all right. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time in this insanity fest called Forager. Peace out. I just killed the chicken. I'm sorry. <laughs>